Hello. Uh, this video will be about fixing this watch. This is a relic. Um, three hands and three sub dials. Um, different functions like uh, 24 hours uh, time format and um, date and day. Um, but the problem is that this watch doesn't work. <laughs> it doesn't tick. So we will find out or we'll try at least to find out what is the problem is. So we need to open the case and remove the movement from the case to take a look. So using this tool we unscrew the case back. Case back is very tight, screwed. This is a kind of not expensive watch, but it looks pretty good and it serves its function. So, good example how to fix a problem which actually we don't know still what is the problem is. Movement holder removed we need to remove battery um, because I want to see if coil is uh, not defective and in the way to measure the resistance of the coil I need to remove battery uh, we need to remove battery anyway put measurement here yeah it shows some resistance it shows about uh, 2.5 2.7 kilo ohms which is normal measurement for the coil so there is problem doesn't which doesn't relate to coil which is good and probably it's mechanical problem so we will go to disassemble this movement to see if something broken inside. There are three screws. One, two, three. Holding the upper plate. And we are unscrewing these uh, screws. And now we can remove this. We need to lift some. There are some pin holding the movement also over here and it's pretty tight sitting Careful with this removal of the plate, and we can see there is water damage. Looks like electronic board is at least it has signs of water coming inside of the watch at some time, some time before. Um, Probably somebody really wanted to check this watch <laughs> on the water um, and 
there is some sealing which didn't work well and water came inside of the watch. Uh, so I am going to replace this board with, because it is pretty much suspected. Yeah, on this side we can see also some rust and it could be that board is defective so I have spare moment which I will use to get another electronic board from here the same way I will remove the upper plate Okay, we can try now, we will put battery back and we will see if this fixed the problem. Yeah, it fixed problem. It was electronic board which was responsible for this problem. Uh, watch didn't work at all. Of course, there was no electronics control <laughs> of the movement now it works fine so that was the problem and um, yeah thank you for watching and i'll try to find uh, what to show in the next video uh, there are some problems always happening to the watches different problems and i will try to cover them in my videos thank you again bye